In this video, you will see how to move table in LibreOffice Writer. It's very easy. As you can see, I am able to hold the table and drag it anywhere inside the LibreOffice document and it's very easy. First, go to the shapes option here and then select the option rectangle. Draw a rectangle of the size you want. Then right click on the shape and select this option add text box. You will see a faint line inside the shape. Now press escape on your keyboard and you will get the cursor inside the shape. Now you can insert the table into the shape. For example, I am selecting 4 by 2 table and to adjust the shape height and width you can drag it through the edges like this. Now we need to remove the background color of the shape and to do that just select the shape. Now here you will see the option of area style or filling. You just have to click on this option and select the option none. So this will remove the background color of the shape. However, note that we still have outer border, a blue color border. So to remove it again click on the blue border. Here you will see the option of line style. Click on the drop down and select the first option where you don't see a line. So this will remove the outer line. Now to remove this extra space below the table, click inside the table and you will see the blinking cursor here and select the font size 2 and press enter. You can also use the anchor points to adjust the space around the table. Now when you click on the table border, you will be able to select the table Click and hold the table and you can move the table freely inside the LibreOffice document. And if you go to the file option and see the print preview, as you can see only the table appears and there are no borders around the table. In this way you can quickly move table in LibreOffice writer freely. Click on that like button, comment below and let me know if this video solved your problem. And don't forget to check out these useful videos if you want to know more about tables in LibreOffice Writer. See you again in the next one.